my dark studio today to film not get real but beauty bar the new show hosted by joan and stephanie and i'm honored to be their first guest listen to the beauty bar here's half of the host of beauty bar <laughs> the half is over there stephanie oh my gosh i'm nervous i like beauty but i don't know enough to like be informative you can do it i believe in you thank you let's do this <laughs> guys i'm all dressed up today because i am going to the gentle monster event with joan so they have a new flagship store in apgujang rodeo Dosan Gongan. it's a huge building with like four floors of gentle monster tambourines and new dake which is like a cafe that they opened gentle monster always goes extra hard with their interior design and concept so i am looking forward to what the new store looks like I'm wearing these reflective chains from unnamed.nyc This zebra top that I haven't worn since my birthday two years ago and these pants from Revolve that I got tailored Rodeo is always pretty far and kind of hard to get to from where I live so I gotta leave like an hour before since I'm gonna be taking the public transportation so let's go! Still waiting for Joan to arrive like sunny but very windy. I got cold and I bought a hot pack from the convenience store on the way here. radio and today's actually the third anniversary of me being a DJ here on Sound K. Can't believe how time flies. Since today marks exactly three years, I just kind of want to record it. <laughs> It's almost a year since I joined you in a couple of weeks and I couldn't be happier. I'm just really grateful for the love, care, and kindness that you and the other listeners have shown me and let me feel. I congratulate you for your third year as a DJ of Sound K. Thank you. I watched you grow and it was fun having so many good memories with you. Everyone's so sweet. I appreciate every single one of you guys in the Sound K fam. Love you guys so much. Thank you. Looking forward to... Wait, why am I talking with this plastic in between us? Looking forward to four years and five years and so on. So, thank you. <gasps> oh my god! I swear, I thought it was for you and no. I was like, Oh, how come they didn't tell me this? No, it's for you! <laughs> no, but it's for you too because, you know, it's no, you, no, you no, graduated. No, no. Oh, oh my for, gosh, thank you. Okay, today's also special because Boytello finally graduated Ooh. from Yonsei University. Yeah, Congrats! Look at him, looks mad legit in his gown. He's such a smarty pants. Officially done with school! What are you gonna do now? produce music. <laughs> Yay! Guys, go check out Boytello's music. I, when I went to Ujiro last time, I bought a bunch of little posters and photo cards because I wanted to decorate my wall with it and I never got around to doing it. I would say they're like Pinterest aesthetic. <laughs> I want to add 
add more or not. I just got a delivery. A bouquet of flowers. What? Oh my gosh. Congrats on three years of radio. So proud of you every day. Miss you so much. I love you. It's from Phoebe. All the way from New York. Oh my God. Thank you, Phoebe. Today is cleaning day. I already have music on. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's do it. And yes, I'm wearing a mask because there's too much dust. So I went to get tested today because it turns out uh, someone who works at the cafeteria at my radio station, her son tested positive for COVID. They advised everyone to get tested. That was at the radio station on Thursday and Friday. We don't even know if she's positive yet either. We're waiting for her test results. I didn't come into direct contact with her, but just in case, um, yeah, I went to get the corona test for the first time. There was a long line, but it went by really quickly and it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. I went with my writer, but she had it worse. So I think it really depends on which person you get for the test. I had a woman who was very gentle with me, so it didn't hurt that much. But my writer, uh, she said that person was pretty aggressive and stuck it very far up her nose. So she was in a lot of pain, but now I just have to wait for the results. It's probably gonna come tomorrow. And I don't know if it's be me being paranoid, but I feel like I'm just like, my body's just really fatigued, even though I slept a lot. I just keep feeling really sleepy. But it's time for dinner, so I got pho delivered. Hopefully this hot soup can make me feel better. <laughs> yeah, I really didn't think that I would ever have to get tested for COVID, but... Yeah, it can happen to anyone. I just hope it comes back negative for everyone. I just woke up to a text saying that I tested negative. Oh my gosh, thank God. I like took a Tylenol before bed last night because I was kind of worried and I just wanted to get a good night's sleep just in case. But oh my gosh. Oh. I was so scared. I don't want to have to go through that again. It's time to start my day. Yay! Today's lip is 3CE's Blurring Liquid Lip in the shade Claret. I got this really cool curling iron from this brand called Insert Name Here. It's called The Waver. It looks like this. They sent me this uh, glove too that you're supposed to wear when using these hot tools just in case so you don't burn your hands and trust me I've burnt my hands a lot 
so this is going to be useful for me so i'm just gonna try to do this all over my hair because my hair has grown so much like look how long my hair is now i'm gonna get a trim real soon probably gonna like trim it up to here because it is so damaged too. I have so many split ends. So I have a lot of layers right now. It's not all the same length. So the curls might look all over the place. But we shall see. I'm going to set it to 310 Fahrenheit. Wait, is that too high? Okay, I'm going to set it to 290 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, by the way, this sweater was gifted to me from Days Days. It's actually a set with these matching shorts. And I love it. I can't wait to wear them around in the summer, springtime, spring, summertime. Okay, I think it's ready, so. Oh, I like it so far. It's just a drag. You know what it is. Yeah. Woods talk free vibes on me. Music is my. I look a little crazy, but I'm digging the look. And now I feel like I have to put like a little bit of eyeliner on. Punching the clock, I get it, gotta go hard with it. Honey, honey, I'm gonna start with it. Coach looking for stuff. Love and peace. Yo. Yes, I got the Frank Ocean Channel Orange album, limited edition. Also got the Cardigans Life LP. Um, both were super expensive. Well, not like super, but they were on the pricier side. This Channel Orange one being uh, 48,500 one and this one being 46,000 one. So yeah the lps that i get are usually around like thirty thousand one, like somewhere between 30 and forty thousand. but yeah this was a little more uh pricey but i think they were worth it especially this one because it is a little more rare this has two lps so i think it's totally worth it this is so pretty guys look at this oh my gosh this is insane it's like marble if you see it close up oh my god it's just beautiful the inside looks like this this one's a plain black one unfortunately but it's all right very happy with my purchases. Let's play the Frank Ocean one. Which song do I want to hear? Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh, well, let's say. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. So pretty. So pretty. Okay, I'm going to play this one. Yes, I am wearing dark gray socks. I ran out of socks, okay? So so while I'm at it, I'm going to film everything that I've been putting off. Dr. Jart sent me a package. Ooh, it's a survival kit. Whoa, what's this? What's this? Wow, we have the Dr. Jart Sika Pear Toner, Spoon and Chopsticks, oh it's an Echo Repair Kit, we have the cream, mask, wow thank you for that, we have, yes, stainless straws, we have hand sanitizer, serum, alcohol swabs, okay so these are like all the things that we need during this pandemic right now so i really appreciate this they know what we want and need i also have a little something from a brand called ram ram studios this is like a fabric poster wow so pretty 
Thank you, Ram Studio. Ooh, lots of static. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. I will be needing the Sika Pear line from Dr. Jar because my skin is most sensitive, not during like the coldest winter time, but the transition time from the winter to the spring. That's when my skin like flips out. The weather is getting warmer in Korea, but it is so, so dry. And last but not least, we have some nail polishes from Hints. This is a Korean brand that has been super popular these days. I really wanted to try their nail polishes because I really like the jelly-like consistency of it. I can't wait to paint my nails. Which color should I go with first? I can definitely use this for something. What should I use this for? I'll think about it.